Hey guys, what's going on? It's me Nathan. Just want to say good evening everyone with the East West Coast. Hope you guys enjoyed your day today here on Monday. You guys are also starting to wake up very positive and very bright. And for this video tonight, of one we want to talk to you guys about is a possible match for next year's WrestleMania 35 event. So let's go into it. Link will be in the description down below. This is from ringsandnews.com, posted by Steve Carrier of the website 43 for April 2018. Posted the day here on uh, Monday, and it says, While well, discussing WWE's decision to not bring, ba uh, bring back Batista as Ron Rossi's WrestleMania 34 partner during today's installment of Wrestling and Server Radio, Dave Meltzer speculated that we may see him return next year for a possible retirement angle against Triple H. And this is what he said. Quote, You know, Batista wants to work with Triple H and next uh, WrestleMania as a retirement match. Will they do it? They may. It's not a bad idea as far as the match goes. Batista, retirement, Hall of Fame, and all that. They asked him to go into Hall of Fame this year, but he didn't want to because he still wants a final run. As many of you are aware, Batista has been lobbying for one last run with, with WWE, and he wants to do it with Triple H in a retirement angle. It'll be interesting to see if we finally get that angle. Well, I gotta say, this is very interesting, and not surprising, because this has been... Rumor and mentioned before uh, over the couple of years since I think WrestleMania 30, where Batista wants to have his retirement match against Triple H. Um, you know, I do think that'll be a good idea and a good touch because when you look at Batista and Triple H, they both have history together. I mean, uh, Triple H was the guy that helped form Evolution with Batista, Rick Flair, and Randy Orton, and the four of them became a big stable in that company during 2003, 2004, and so on and so on before they broke up. And so, um, to have Batista and Triple H in the same ring for this match would be like nostalgia, basically, for me. And, you know, I'll never forget, you know, when, when uh, Triple H and Batista had their feud at 2005 at WrestleMania, where Batista won the World Raid Championship from Triple H and had a big run with it, beating Triple H three times in a row, uh, one at WrestleMania, one at Backlash, and one at Vengeance. And that was something I'll never forget. Even uh, Batista, um, you know, um, uh, his mom worked at a uh, company where my mom worked at. And she was able to get a, um, you know, Batista's mom was able to get um, a signing copy of a WWE magazine, Hall, uh, Vengeance Hell in Cell edition, um, signed. And... So I mean that so that uh, Batista signed it, and then I I uh, received it in the mail, and I was pretty much happy. I loved it. Um, I still have that, you know, in, in my room somewhere. Um, but uh, you know, I'll never forget that, and that was when I never forget that moment. And that was when um, during time Batista, he was the guy, he was the man, he was the top of the food chain, and him having his retirement, you know, next year I think would be fitting for him. And him to go into the Hall of Fame uh, would be much more fitting because he, he does deserve it. Along with, with plenty of others who have not been in the Hall of Fame yet for WWE. Uh, but I do hope we do get to see that match between him and Triple H. And maybe add Randy Orton to that mix. You know, because for, for Randy Orton, his career to me is kind of winding down a little bit. I mean, winding down a little bit. I do think that he does need to have a... Uh, retire match at some point maybe not now but in the next couple of years but if he does it with Batista Triple H and makes a triple threat match then I'll I'll enjoy it even more but tell me console guys what guys do you think about this do you like it do you not like it are you more neutral about a possible match for next year's WrestleMania 35 event and so tell me in the comment section down below don't forget to like this video don't forget to always subscribe to the channel guys and until next time it's Dane saying peace take care I will see you guys later for it's really coming up uh, tomorrow morning or in a couple of minutes, so stay tuned. So, on this time, take care, guys. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Have a good night, guys. See you guys later for it's really coming up uh, tomorrow. And uh, have a good night. I will see you guys tomorrow. And uh, I am out. All right, guys. Bye.